where plants live adaptations land or terrestrial plants land habitat can be subdivided into many areas plants growing in each of these areas need to adjust to the kind of weather amount of rainfall type of soil and other factors found in that place plants in the plains plants in deserts plants in mountains plants in heavy rainfall areas plants along the sea coast and plants in marshy or swampy areas plants in the plains plants growing in flat plains have more space to spread out usually they grow several branches and have flat leaves these help water vapor to evaporate and keep the tree cool when the climate goes hot flat leaves also help to trap a lot of sunlight some of these trees lose all their leaves at once in autumn new leaves start growing in spring examples mango banyan neem people mulberry etc plants in deserts hot deserts are sandy dry and very hot places there is scarcity of rainfall and a lot of direct sunlight falls on the plants the soil in desert is sandy and unable to hold much water strong dry winds and extreme temperatures make survival tough plants store water in their stems and leaves and are called succulents long root system go deep into the ground to absorb the available water some plants have very small seasonal leaves that only grow after it rains the lack of leaves helps reduce water loss some plants are leafless and conduct photosynthesis in their green stems leaves covered with hair provide shed for the plant and thus reduce water loss spines in desert plants discourage animals from eating plants for water waxy coating on stems and leaves help reduce water loss plants in mountains most plants in mountains are tall straight and cone shaped they have needle like leaves the needle shape prevents too much water loss and helps shed snow easily waxy coating on the needles prevents evaporation and loss of water the dark color of the leaf allows more solar heat to be absorbed plants in heavy rainfall areas the plants are evergreen means they do not lose their leaves example rice lily cashew pineapple sugarcane cotton rubber and teak plants along the sea coast the plants are adapted to grow in salty water and high rainfall the seeds of plants growing in coastal regions are carried from place to place or dispersed by water plants in marshy or swampy areas these areas have clay soil that is very sticky it is difficult for plants to grow in such areas as air cannot reach the roots example mangroves with their breathing roots are well adapted to grow in swampy areas thanks for watching keep watching keep learning